and number one. They snubbed him at the Grammys, but you will not be snubbed here on the Catch Up Podcast. My number one album for 2020. The Weekend After Hours. Air horn. I've been trying to call. I've been on my own for long enough. Maybe you can show me how to love. Maybe. <laughs> I gotta turn it down. I gotta turn it down. 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 Okay. That was my number one album of 2020. I've been jamming this all year. This whole album. I, I pretty much like the whole album. It follows suit of Starboy. Starboy was, you know, there was that hip hop and then you had that electronic 80s feel. And even more so on this album right here. And um, I like how he came out with the videos and he's been playing his character with the with the red suit. And you feel like he's been wearing that damn suit everywhere he goes. I'm growing my fro out so I can wear this suit next Halloween. <laughs> yeah, man, I, I thought, you know, that that whole concept of that album and this guy's just went from being broken hearted, uh, you know, at the start of the album, he's pretty much in the club throwing dollars feeling sorry for himself and then you know he goes from that to uh, um just f this in uh heartless um never need a chick on what a chick need right um to back to being in love and uh, to um the last daggum song he talks about freaking um I, I want to cut you out my veins. I need to get you out of my life. Um, you know, until I bleed it out. That's that's the last song. I like that too. Um, and then freaking um, what's that other song, man? Is it Faith? Uh, well, he said he wants he won't uh, want the chick to overdose with him and <laughs> all kind of stuff. Uh, like I I I don't know anything about the life the weekend lives, but. I like him singing about it, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I mean this this whole album is just awesome. Love the weekend. Um, I think his later stuff is better. I I like this weekend better than the darker weekend. The beauty behind the madness. Even though I like that album too, but I I like this mix of hip hop and uh eighties vibe, and you know I I I just love it. 